All right, guys, we're back for another Dokkan Battle video. So <clears throat> I wanted to do another run in the God Event here uh, with LR Gogeta. Because um, this unit, I feel like, is much better when you're running them with SDR Vegito. But obviously doing that, um, it's not really possible to go, like, type advantage for Gogeta. Because then you're putting SDR Vegito at type disadvantage. That's not going to work, right? So here we're going to jump in. We're going to go into the toughest fight probably in the game. I think Belmod probably is the hardest boss in the game. Uh, I am tempting fate a little bit by using double Evolution Blue Vegeta team. Oh my god, what a great opening rotation right there, huh? Okay. He locks us all and then she's going to instant kill us, I'm sure. Okay, let's see what happens. No lock. Okay, all right. We, we, oh, <laughs> Yeah, that's, I mean, that's unfortunate. That is not a great opening rotation for us. Um, So I'm thinking that Gogeta, right? This LR Gogeta unit. We should be pretty good to go against Belmod or Vermoth or however the hell you say his name. I think we should be pretty much um, impervious to a lot of the damage he's going to do. At least with Gogeta, right? Um, we certainly could have some issues... Most of this team should be able to tank him rather well. I don't know how easy it'll be to transform into Gogeta either. Um, that's the thing, right? Like, in sort of like the war between who's better, Vegito and Gogeta, one thing I really like, I do like Vegito's transformation quite a bit better, right? I feel like in all the difficult content, Super Battle Road Sages, God Events, GT Legendary Goku Event, you're much more likely to be under 77% HP on turn 4 than above 70% HP on turn 4, right? So, because of that, um, I just, I, I don't know. I, it's like, yeah, you could say like, oh, they're made to be run together, sure. But there's many stages in the game, there's many teams that they're on that they're, they don't share. Like, you're not always running them together. It's not how it works, right? So, you can't just blanket say that. Um, okay. I guess I'm going to float off Gohan. Gohan getting sealed really sucks because he gives himself a lot of defense, right? Uh, I guess we'll do this. I mean, sure. We're probably going to take a significant amount of damage if Gohan or Jiren get super attacked. Let's see. Yeah, again, Belmod is really annoying because he locks, he seals. It's just like the amount of shit he does. He lowers your defense on super attack. He can double super. Like, he does everything, right, as a boss. And it's like, the thing about him locking, it's like um, Battlefield Omega Shenron locking too, right? Where, you know, when you have limited items, lock is devastating, right? Like, in Battlefield, you can't do anything about it. You get locked and you're cucked. Um, here, it's like you've only got the two items, just the one item slot. This is bad. All right. Yeah, Gohan got sealed, so we weren't able to raise his defense. That hurts quite a bit. All right, Glizzy Gobbler Weiss going to jump in and just slurp it down. Oh, my God, Weiss. Chill. All right. Um, <laughs> I think I'm going to use an item here. My sixth or even my seventh sense is telling me, yeah, you had better go ahead and use an item. So, I think that's exactly what I'm going to do. Um, well, So, Khalifla and Goku and Vegeta, by the way, work pretty well together. Saiyan lineage, Saiyan warrior race, and fierce battle. Um, that's obviously, you know, good for them. Um, and then, of course, you know, with Evolution Blue Vegeta, we have most of their link set active. Except for experienced fighters and shocking speed. So, I mean, this is a really good turn for them. I'm going to use an item. I mean, we already do Goku and Vegeta are not. They can't take damage in this event. Like, like I, I would, I really want Gogeta to get super attack later on. Um, because I think like, you know, maybe like a hundred K or less he could take, especially if Gogeta supers first, we'll take almost no damage. Um, the big problem though, is that like, again, you only have two items to play with, right? In the God event. Like, that's why like, Again, people say, like, oh, just use an item, but you're good. Okay, but they're power balancing difficult events now by limiting your item usage, right? Like, that's the easiest way they could just, like, not make the event have, you know, 800 health bars and really stack it up like that. They just limit your items, right? So you really don't have as much um, opportunity to play around, right? Because that's sort of the thing we got going on here is, like, Gogeta's got to be above 70% HP, 
Yeah, all right. Well, I'm glad I used an item because this would have been death. This is still going to hurt really bad. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, so, I guess I'm just going to do this so we can transform. Uh, but, like, that's it. We, we don't now have items. The other thing, too, is I actually do want to use Gogeta. This team I'm using is ultra powerful in terms of offense. I'm not going to go for, like, the 18 key super attack and stuff like that. Because um, I want Pelmod to actually, you know, be able to survive and take a hit from Gogeta. Wow, did we tear through this fast. I mean, you know, with, with Evolution Blue Vegeta's Jiren, Goku, and Frieza, like, we have a lot of really, really heavy hitters here, right? Like, if I went, you know, 18 key super attack for Goku and Vegeta, Belmod, he would be looking like that picture of Patrick, man, with the ice cream all over him. That's... <laughs> Alright, so we are going to get Gogeta to come out, which is going to be sick. Um, but, I mean, you guys saw, like, it was just like, alright, spamming items here. Hmm. The other thing, too, is, again, I, I wanted to use Gogeta, um, like, type advantage. I guess I we could try a Kamehameha, because, okay, so all of Gogeta's um, teams, right, that he's got right here, um, so time limit, the, the roster's not really good enough. Fusion, we're not running in here, right? Because, again, we'd want, like, a tech leader as well. Pure Saiyans, no. Join Forces, not going to work. Movie Heroes is not going to work. Super Saiyan is not going to work, right? We could do Kamehameha with AGL Gohan, but we have to hide him. He would get hit really hard. Like, it's like we could sort of maneuver around him a little bit. Um, and he could stack up a bit, but AGL LR Gohan will get killed in here. Other what Warriors can't do. I mean, maybe we could try Final Trump card with Vegito Blue, right? And just let him dodge and base. Um, uh, we might finish this up and then and then quickly take a look at it. Um, but then Connected Hope, no. Power of Revival is what we're running right now. And then, you know, so... Uh, it's, it's, again, uh, the God Event, there's many factors to how to use characters in the God Event and stuff like that. It's you mostly want to be going type advantage. Like many teams are just like not runnable, right? Like you you, you can't run movie hero because AGO Blue Gogeta instantly dies in here basically, unless you get really lucky with a thirty percent chance to dodge and stuff. So I don't know. All right, so now we have our boy Gogeta out. Uh, super attack at the end. Okay, yeah, we could do that. We 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 could actually do this. Um, I really wish I could. I want to. Damn it! I want to miss a super attack with Gohan, but that's not going to be possible, unfortunately. Okay. We're going to get a, a full 24. What's his defense? 155k. I really hope Belmod can survive. I think he can, actually. Yeah, I don't. we're not going to finish him off. So let's see Gogeta um, super attacking first, which will raise his defense by 30%. Um, and then also having his damage reduction against Belmod. We'll see what he does against his super attack. Now, if you do get the Gogeta fusion, remember, he still has what I consider the most powerful ability in the game. And that's the scouter effect, seeing where enemy super attacks are. It just doesn't get better than that. At 3.8, not the craziest right there. I mean, I don't... With Tech Ultimate Gohan, we have almost nothing. Just Fierce Battle. Is Fierce Battle the only link we have with Tech Ultimate Gohan? I think so. Uh, yeah, it is. 131k, that's really good. That's, 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 that's really good. I, I, I will definitely take that. That is not bad whatsoever. Um, okay, so now we have our boy Belmod. We could probably just... I could just active skill with Vegeta and Jiren and finish him off. Now, quickly, before we finish up, I do want to go take a look at Tech Kamehameha and Tech Final Trump Card. Well, I guess we could do Final Trump Card slash Patara and see what the tech units are looking like. See, that's one of those things where it's like, you know, easy A's, again, are, are the best thing in this game and just such a powerful thing. Because it's like LR Goku Black and Zamasu. You know, I, I I look at how good like I did a level ten link video on them recently and they look so good, dude. Like, you know, like 
add that unit. Like, it's just... The God event is getting easier as time is going on because many more teams are actually viable, right? The thing about it previously is that many of these teams just straight up were not even really that viable, right? Because, like, it's like you need a leader, you know, and, like, a full typing, basically, to go against these gods uh, of type advantage. Um, and now that we're starting to get, like, old EZAs, you know, like, maybe, like, AGL Goten's EZA, the Physical Kid Trunks, right? Like, all these typings for all these categories were just getting, like, massively buffed, which just makes it um, more realistic that we could actually, like, properly run these characters. Um, so, again, let me just quickly, before we finish up, let me take a look at Tech Kamehameha, and then let's also take a look at Final Trump Card and sort of see, like, you know, like, what, like, squads we could potentially build here. So, let's just go um, Kamehameha at the start. Again, I don't really like using uh, Trunks and Goten in the difficult content as leader for Kamehameha so much um, because of the fact that their leader skill defense is only 130%. I really have grown to very much like that 170% defense, right? Previous, back in the day, I, I always preferred 170% HP and attack, but now with like the God event and Extreme Super Battle Road, I just feel like that 170% defense is so important. All right, so let's here, let's, we, we wanna put uh, Gohan as our lead. We could, we could throw UI Goku in there as well. Um, Goku and Vegeta. This isn't that great, honestly, it's not. Yeah, the, a lot of these guys are, like, old and stuff. This is not the greatest. Ah, man. I, I just look at easy A's, right? Super Saiyan 3 Goku, Tech Vegito Blue. Like, they're going to make it a lot better. Um, I mean, we could do a rotation of, like, Kid Trunks and uh, LR Gohan and Goten. Eh, Kamehameha, just with Tech, is not really blowing me away right there. Uh, it's like, I feel like I'm gonna run it and I'm gonna want to do just like this, right? Like, like just something like that and then add Tech Khalifa on there. Maybe get rid of Int UI Goku, um, and put Tech Khalifa. That's sort of probably how I'd try and run Kamehameha for this unit. Um, <clears throat> alright, let's try Patar and Final Trump card then. Okay, so we go Vegito Blue. Let's see what we got for Tech. Uh, it's not great. Again, we'd run them... Candy Vegito, unfortunately, cannot even be run in the event, I believe, because Candy Vegito is a nuking character, which really sucks, because Candy Vegito would be quite good here. Yeah, it's just, again, easy A's. Tech Super Saiyan 4, Gogeta needs an easy A. This guy needs his easy A. LR, Goku, Black, and Zamasu need their easy A. Super Saiyan 3, Goku needs his easy A. So, I mean, the thing about running this Gogeta in the God event here is you are pretty much probably going to be taking them type neutral. Um, cause the only tech leader of any of their teams, I mean, you can run Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta on Fusion, but that's an L. You don't want to do that. Um, and then it's just like the LR Gogeta themselves for time limit and connected hope, but you're not going to run either of those teams. And then just tech Vegito for final trump card. So like, you know, you're going to be running this unit, uh, type neutral in the God event. The good news is that. They definitely, absolutely are good enough to go type neutral, which is... That says a lot about the unit, right? Remember, SDR Vegito, too. I feel like a lot of people have misinterpreted... Like, they act like you can't run him in the God Event now. No, 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 no. The base SDR Vegito completely dominates the God Event. Transforms Vegito. If he gets hit 10 times or he gets super attacked, yeah, you're dead. But, you know, that's why you can make tactical use of that active skill... And the thing is, you could use his active skill whenever you want to, right? So it's like, while, yes, he's not invincible, you can't put him in a million attacks. Uh, like, it's very easy to sort of use that Vegito, you know, use his active skill, see where the super attack is, maneuver, you know, things the way you want to. Like, there's a lot of sort of tactics you could use with SCR Vegito. And, again, it's not really as possible with this Gogeta unit because it's not as easy to do their active skill, right? Although Gogeta can definitely tank much better um, uh, against the gods after he fuses. So let me know what you guys think. Um, still a really good unit. You know, I, I really like them as a top five unit in the game. I probably would put Gogeta personally at like number four, I think. I feel comfortable putting LR Gogeta as like the fourth best unit in the game. Uh, definitely quite good. So again, let me know what you guys think. Uh, thanks guys for watching and I'll catch y'all next time.